become another incredibly powerful moment was when the judge talked about sitting in the courtroom and thinking of the legacy, the legal legacy of this family. He talked about how he had made the decision to have a portrait of Alec Murdoch's grandfather removed from that courtroom so that he could get a fair trial. He said that he respected the state's decision not to seek the death penalty in this case, but said, as I look around this courtroom and think about how your family, including but you, they... tried cases in this courtroom for over a century. They so will not probably been instances uh, involving your family members. He said they beat me every day and every night. For crimes that are much no, lesser they don't. than this. He said he, he was killed very them. struck by that. Uh, our courtroom uh, producer, our producer was inside no, watching they, these they, they don't, as she could. No. She said that Alec Murdoch did not they don't give a fuck. at all when he was in the court today. He only looked forward and then he was taken out. Peter Yes. Uh, Barbara with really great description of what it was like in that courtroom today. Laura Jarrett, I want to ask you if I can quickly, you know, your reaction to some of this. But first, I want to play for our audience what we heard from one of the yeah. jurors who spoke to ABC. Take a listen. Hey, there. hey. What are you doing? Um, I'm doing, um, I don't know how I'm doing. You don't know. You want to say hi to everybody? Who is that? But that's my family. Um, Let's say um, your hands covering it. Um, I'm blogging. Hello, it, um, how are you? Oh, you're recording. Yeah, I'm, I be, I record my status. I'm time. Jennifer. I'm his speech therapist. And um, I am, um, and some of the members of my YouTube are my family. Oh, okay. He's recording. Oh, Oh, oh my, my Good lord. Good afternoon. Oh, my babes are here. All the babes are here. <laughs> well, well, I'm, I'm, I'm going in right here. I'll pick up with you later, okay? Okay. 